So we are going spider loco in our today's video. As you all know, December 17 is coming right up in this month and we all know that in this December 17 we're gonna get the new Spider-Man Homeless. So what we're gonna do in this month is we're gonna have to try to get the new power of the new Spider-Man that we have. So I'm recreating the new Spider-Man power by using a simple command here in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. And if you think this is cool and crazy, make sure to hit the subscribe button right now down below. Give a like, hit the subscribe button, slap the bell icon, and always be notified every time for the search video and stuff. But now let's go to it and let's get started. What the flip is this? My editing is so messed up. But now guys, I'm gonna have to show you guys how to do this thing. But first, we're gonna have to turn on all the commands. So flip the one on. That is a tagging command. And next command, put the one on. Flick the outer command. Here we go. Flick it. Outer lever. Flick it. The outer lever. Flick it. And let's go gamers. So each of these command has its own different types of purpose in this Spider-Man power. The other one is web sling, the other is cancel swing, the other is stick to the walls, the other is spidey perks and spidey sense. So we can have other spidey sense and other types of power in here and this one you're only gonna have to flick one. So we're gonna need two types of item, I mean three types of item, no two types of item but it has actually the three kinds of items. So first we have here a string, a web shooter which we use the um, crossbow and we need two of it. It's fair enough because uh, Spider-Man has two web shooter and reload it just like this. We have a web shooter and this one, this string is for the web cancel. Enable to cancel every time you try to swing the web shooter, you can actually just drop the item string and you can cancel the web, the web sling. All right, it's time to go to the phase one, which is the web sling. So we're gonna try the web sling first before doing the other powers of the Spider-Man. So first, oops, I actually very messed up. So we're gonna have to turn on the commands because I don't think I actually turn the commands right to the game rule. So let me do this command. So we do slash game rule and make the command block output, I mean command block enabled true and there we have it. But before that, let's gear up. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to use our web shooter. And first we have here, shoot it just like this. And we actually use the particle effects. And let me climb, climb this wall, okay? Just, just climb this wall. Okay, next up, so we're gonna have to try shooting it to the next wall. So it doesn't actually, I mean, the stick of the walls command or the, every time you stick to the wall, there's actually a bit of delay. As you can see, every time I shoot my arrow, all I have to do is get teleported in it and not get stick instantly. So it still has some delay effects, but yeah, I'm doing everything I can do in this one. But we can try doing it as far as the arrow can get. So this is our web shooter here in Minecraft. So we won't gonna use any like fishing rod or any kinds of rod. Cause actually it might be a little outdated, but I think the arrow one is much more easier and simpler and much, much more efficient if I say so, other than the fishing rod. The fishing rod has actually its own limit where it can just shot not that very far away but if I use a bow or a whip shooter so I can use an arrow to shoot as far as I can and able to swing as far as I structure that I can just look at this let me shut this one out and I can use the item string to cancel out by dropping it and here we go get cancelled okay very easy and very simple because uh, every time you use the web shooter, you can actually just move freely. So it only teleport you to the direction where you can actually just get sling. All right, boys, let's test this one out at the third person view, and there we have it. All you have to do is drop a structure or as far as you can, a wall or a house, anything, and you can just actually just go teleport right into it with a little bit of uh, explosion particle that I use as an uh, effects every time I shoot the web shooter. All right, next up is stick to the wall. So we're making a progress to the phase two where we can actually just stick to the wall. All to do is face a wall and every time you face a wall, you can actually just stick on it and get teleported instantly right above or right to the top on it. So you can actually just parkour using the stick on the walls, but it's pretty much more hard to use. I would say that it's pretty hard to use the stick on the wall power command. But other than its web shooter and its stick on the walls, it actually has its own different types of perks. 
For example, we see movie Spider-Man, it actually has super strength double than a normal person and actually has a bit of super jump. So it's not as strong other than uh, it's not as strong like the other superheroes or Venom, but it actually have enormous strength enough for a normal person. So for example, Spider-Man and Venom, if you compare them, I think Venom is much more stronger than Spider-Man. That's why I only feel a less of power to the um, Spider-Man. So it's not much as strong as like my Venom command power, but I actually have enough strength to two punch or one punch a mob. But I don't know about the bosses, okay? Moving on to the next phase, which is phase number, I don't know. But other than its super strength and super jump, Spider-Man has a spidey sense. Look at this. This is our spidey sense. Yes, that is our spidey sense. So the spidey sense give you a speed or a haste movement for a, like five seconds a single time. So every time, or I mean the spidey sense only get activated every time there's a mobs nearby you. So there's actually a mobs right to the radius of eight or to the radius of five. Your spidey sense get activated instantly, like automatically get activated and you're gonna get a haste movements and a super strength like much more double or anything but your vision got wider so you can see your enemies right nearby or even right to your back so if you do it to like third person view look at this you can actually have the spidey sense and you can have super fast speed movements enable to escape or to attack the um the mobs that get triggered to your spidey sense So there is one thing I want you guys to know, just like I said earlier, Spider-Man power can't one punch any mob, so it can actually just take like 2 punches for a mob, or for other mobs like 3 punches, 2 punches, I don't know about the chickens, but Spider-Man is not that strong compared to Venom just like my other commands, so yeah, it might be probably why it's a little bit weaker than Venom command. Alright, enough of all of this talking and let's go right into the commands. Bruh. All right, it's time for me guys to show you all the commands. So first we're gonna have go to our tagging command. This tagging command is very important, enable to activate or enable to access all of these commands that we have here. So first we have here the tagging command. So we got here tag at in name because the lower hero. So you put your own name on it. So I put my own name. So you better put your own name. Don't copy my name, okay? So we gonna put add spidey on it, okay? And I'm gonna put it through P, Uncle and need redstone, it doesn't actually matter, but as long as it is not a chain command, we're gonna work on so. So first we have here the web sling command. So this web sling command is pretty easy. So first we have here execute at A tag, goes by the close bracket, try to attack at the type close arrow, comma to radius of three, add then swing. So we're gonna put it through P, Uncle Shell, and need redstone. And for our second part is we have here execute at A tag, goes Spidey, close bracket, three arrow which point upward, DP at A tag, goes Spidey, close bracket, then another arrow which point upward, which actually there's a tree of it. I put 0 0.4 before we end that one. Facing at E tag, goes swing, comma C equals one in close bracket. Chain and crucial and always active. And next part is we have your the execute at E tag go swing, three to the particle Minecraft explosion underscore particle. And yeah, basically that's it. So it's up to you if you want to put a different kind of particle, but this particle pretty suit me well if I say so, okay? Chain and crucial and always active, okay? Better make sure to uh, do all that. And if you want to cancel your swing, there's actually a way to cancel a swing and able to drop a string. And we have that this command right off. So we have your test for at e type equals item which we rename into string or actually just a natural way of name string. So we put close bracket net, so put repeat uncrucial and the redstone and this part is a redstone comparator. And we have here for our next command which is gonna kill the arrow, kill at e type equals arrow, enable to cancel the swinging command and we put repeat uncrucial and the redstone, okay? And this part is we have your right to the top, we have a kill at e type equals item name equals string close bracket. Chain uncrucial and always active and this part is give at a type of spidey which we're gonna get a string once again because every time we drop the string we lost the string. Chain uncrucial and always active and there we have it okay. For next part is to stick to walls or how to climb to walls just like spidey or just like real spider okay. 
So first we have here the execute at a tackle spidey, close bracket 3 till the test 4 block, then 2 arrow which point upward without space put 1, then arrow which point upward and without space put 1, space, air, space, 0. Okay, better make sure to do that. And we will repeat actual and the breadstone. And for next part is we have the resident comparator once again and this part is just a dummy command. As you can see this dummy command doesn't actually have any particular command on it. But the important thing is we're gonna have to put a resident uh, torch in that part and we're gonna put right to the top of the resident torch is another command. And this part is the way main command enable to stick through walls. Execute at p type calls by the close bracket till the execute at e type calls player. Then put tilde space two tilde without space space tp then space two tilde without space 0 0.2 without space put tilde. Put it to repeat and crucial and need redstone. And this part is we have here the spidey perks which I can actually see uh, Spider-Man has super strength but not as strong as Venom or any other villains or any other superheroes but it has a supernatural strength if I say so. So first we have here the spidey strength so we're gonna put effect at A type goes by the close bracket strength space 1 space 5 space 2. So we're gonna put it to repeat Uncle and need redstone and this part is just an another spidey strength power so we have here the jump boost effect at a tag goes by the close rocket jump underscore boost space one space three and space true so if you're asking where is his super speed so yeah just like i said chain uncle and always active the super speed is we actually put it right in here so the super speed is we rename it or we use it to sense or for the spidey sense so this one is actually called the spidey sense so let me rename it okay so if you like here spidey sense so the spidey sense so the spidey sense is a different thing so first in the command we have your execute at the type calls exclamation player so it won't gonna sense any player turtle the test for at p uh, put r equals 8 so you can actually just define it like not detect yourself or you can just use it to detect player or any kind of map so for me just let's just use this for a different type of hostile maps okay so we're gonna put it through P Uncle and need redstone. And we have here another resin comparator and we have here another command which put effect at P tackle by the close bracket speed space five space five space true. Okay. And yeah, basically that's it the command. And if you wanna do this or if you think you can do this in your own world, but now gamers, thanks for watching. And if you do like the video, give a like, hit the subscribe button and slap the bell icon. And now thank you for watching. Bye bye, love you, all peace out, bye bye. Ah!